Hey, welcome back to the channel and welcome to the next episode of Tutorial Tuesday. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install Steam in Linux on your Chromebook. Now, I did a very similar tutorial several months ago, but the method that I used for that tutorial, I think something has changed and it doesn't seem to be working anymore. A lot of people have said they have had problems. So I looked into it and I found a much simpler way to do it. So kind of wanted to do a refresher on that tutorial. Now, before you get started, I'm going to assume that you have Linux beta support turned on on your Chromebook and you also have GPU acceleration turned on. If you don't have either of those, check out these videos. I'll link them right up here. Uh, I got videos to show you how to set up both of those and then come back and pick this video up where you left off and we're going to jump right into the tutorial now. All right, so here we are on our Chrome OS desktop and the first thing we need to do is go out to the Steam site. So let's do a quick search for it and go to install Steam up at the top here. Click on that and then we want to make sure that we download the one for Linux or Steam OS. So just click on that, it'll automatically download. It's a very small download. So the next thing you wanna do is go out to your files app on your Chromebook, go to the downloads area and grab the uh, steamlatest.deb. Now I have two on here because I downloaded it twice, once for testing and once for this video, but you just need to copy the one and you can just click on install with Linux beta. What this will do is it'll copy it over to your Linux partition and start the install. You can see a install progress bar down in the right hand corner here. And we're just going to wait for that to finish. All right, so now we are all installed. It says the app is available in our terminal. So we can also go into our apps list here and it should show up. Inside our Linux apps, we now have Steam. So we can click on that. It's gonna go through and do an update and uh, make sure it has all the files it needs. There's a bunch that we need to update here. So we're gonna hit Y. Just let this run through all its updates. So now it downloaded everything that it needs and it set it up. So we just need to hit enter. And now Steam is loading. It's uh, Steam does this every time where the first time you load it, it looks for updates and automatically downloads that. So we're just going to go and grab those real quick. This will take just take a few minutes. Okay, so now the setup for Steam is all done and we can go ahead and log in with our account. And there we are, now we can go and install Steam games from our library or from the store just like we would on any other machine. All right, so that's all there is to it. This is a much simpler method to install Steam, and I think people are gonna have much greater success doing it this way. If you have any questions on anything that I went over in this video, leave them down in the comment section. If you have any problems, also leave those down in the comment section. Either I or hopefully somebody else in the community can help you out with those. If you like this tutorial and you found it useful, hit that thumbs up. If you really liked it and haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for stopping by.